Alright, welcome back, guys. Well, I've probably been thinking about it for a little bit. I decided to just do an entirely decked character, which means I'm going to use a light shield if I still got it. No, I did grab it. I just rely on speed to get me through where we Um, And later, that I'll do, uh, next, I'll probably do an intelligence build because I've always wanted to do just intelligence. I've never done it before. This kind of gives me the excuse. Uh, yeah. I'll, I'll keep the uh, eagle shield just in case. Cause there's some bosses that, well, if I die 30 times, I'll I'll have to whip it out. So right now we're gonna go straight to Sun's Fortress to New Anne Orlando because I want to get the Lord Vessel. I hate having to walk everywhere. Especially when I forget something and want to run back. I was wearing wolf ring. Okay, I'm gonna need a wolf ring. <sighs> this way back to here. I gotta walk my happy ass all the way across the map. It's okay though. Except that you guys have to sit and deal with it. Now, I'm struggling with my video editing software, if you haven't noticed the poor quality of audio. Um, for some reason I couldn't get AVID Mux, AVI D Mux, to uh, allow two sets of audio tracks, one from the game, one from my audio. So I did a quick search online for free stuff because I'm not about to pay a grand for video editing software. And Windows Movie Maker actually works pretty well. So this next video is going to be uploaded with that, and uh, yeah, maybe I'm a little behind the times on that, but holy jeez, I forgot about those guys. Yeah, some poison. Let me out of here. Now, I may not be doing it 100% right, but if you swap your sword and shield back and forth while running through this muck, Keep stamina longer, and if you notice, you move a little bit faster. Now, after we go through Sen's Fortress, I'm going to take the time to join the Forest Hunters Covenant, and then steal the uh, Dark Wood Green Ring, so I can do the flippy, crazy ninja kicky stuff, which would be cool. I'm going straight dexterity, might as well do it with style. Plus you get more invincibility frame from the flips. Alright, now earlier I didn't show it, but back... Here, I'll show you if I can come over here. From the last, next level down... Oh, no, it's right here. You can run that way, and to the left up there, you'll find another fire keeper, so... But it's an ass pain because you got four guys shooting toxin darts at you. Took me a couple tries because I didn't really want to go through and methodically kill them all, so I just kind of dropped down there, grab it, died, and then respawn. Easier for me that way. Alright. Should have the whole video just me walking back. So this is why I like having the Lord Vessel. It makes all this unnecessary. Save buttloads of time. I don't care about you, because all you drop is piles of poo. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting. If you're sprinting and you want to be able to go directly into a roll, um, Hold your shield out in front of you. When you tap roll, you'll just go straight into it instead of jumping. Which helps, so you don't jump somewhere and get stuck in the middle of the, uh... Yeah, this one. <clears throat> in, in the middle of your jump, you get smashed. Or you can roll out of the way and keep moving. Now, for uh, when we go down to the crypts or whatever, 
I'm going to use a store straight sword. I'm going to have to raise my faith a little bit, but that way when you kill stuff, it stays dead versus having to chase down all the stupid fire head people. The uh, lamp. Kill lamp. It makes it easier, especially in the boss battle, too. You kill a guy, he doesn't come back and keep killing you later. So you can take out all the guys running around and then just focus on Nito. Makes it easier. Er. Now, I don't want to talk to these guys because they're just rude. Anyway, they pretty much tell you to piss off. Don't disturb the lady and all that nonsense. But later... If I was doing a faith build, that lady comes in handy because you can get the Wrath of God from her. Uh, some other useful spells too. Mainly use Wrath of God from her though. But, there's no magic this time for me, except for heal. Which, I'm only keeping that because... If I go Sunbro style and help somebody out, I'll have something to heal versus just spending my humanity the whole time. Now hopefully I can do this run without getting killed 50 times. That's the hope at least. Which got no, I got enough to do that one more. And I don't want to do that because stability is terribly low in that. But it'll work. Mainly because of the stamina boost. So I'll make sure all my shit's repaired first. I don't want to run up there with a half broken sword. But then She got a break on me again. <sighs> Alright. Now it's always fun to uh, draw their attention first. Like, hey, come on, assholes. And then run this way, stuff on the pressure plate. Let them get stabbed in the back. Freaking hard. Love that fast roll. Come on, big guy. Oh, yeah, that failed. One more time. Come on. Oh, failed again. Fuck. Well, there's that. Yeah, I think I need to practice that more, especially with doing a light build. Can't really tank through hits as well. Sacrifice speed for defense. Sacrifice defense for speed, I mean. Try to do this part of live so I can hopefully get some invasions, see if we can kill some people. It'll be fun. I actually don't mind getting invaded because it's always nice to pick your skills up against somebody. And I think I actually have enough to maybe level up. We'll see. Now that I'm looking at it. And no, not of us. It's amazing how fast those things uh, add up. need a ton of souls just to get where you need uh, to level up once. Now later, uh, I have no projectile weapon right now. And I mean, I can use my, my really crappy bow, but I'm going to get the Black Bow of Ferris and use that, because that thing is amazing. It's got super long uh, shot range and 
It's like 65 versus everything else, which is like 50. And if you get the Hawk Ring, you can shoot super far. Come on, you. I'll do my falling around right here. I'm just gonna tough it out. Now this one I've noticed, it's much easier to just rush that thing instead of sitting here waiting. Whew, that was close. Oh, you tricky bastard. Sword. Need one more, I think, for now, but. <sighs> See you later, man. Now, back through there is where you can unlock um, Big Hat Logan, but you gotta rotate the, the ball thrower thingy down this way, and being that, I'm not gonna do any intelligence. Did I go the wrong way? I don't know if there's any point in me doing that, other than there's like a big soul in there. Oh. Is he down there? Yes, he is. Guys, hey, you. My onion bro just kind of sits there and watches. He's like, No, you got this, man. It's cool. Wow, I wasn't ready for that. Just like that whipped. Sliding all down there. Man. Now that up there, that item is uh, the show tells that that curved sword that uh, mm. Knight Lodric uses. Mm. I don't use it sometimes. Oh, forgive me. I was absorbed in thought. I am indeed my opportunity. I run back up against the wall. For a ball to be precise. I am a I am a bit of stuff. Yeah, just sit there, man. Don't even try. It's not like you could uh, tank through like two or three hits from those balls with that heat armor of yours on. No, you just hang out there, and wait for somebody else to fix it. I got this, dude. Don't worry. Oh! Couldn't see it. Here, and get past this guy. And get the ring of steel protection. All I'm gonna do is get past this asshole, which is not hard. Next back here. This comes in handy. It really boosts the defense. Pretty significant, actually. But I want to keep the wolf thing on until I get my uh, stamina up high enough to continue on without using the habit ring. Not going to use that. Oh man. Oh, it's cool. Oh! 
thinking that was the one that came from the side. Slightly just brush up against them, if I can kill you. And I missed. Son of a bitch. Oh well. Ugh. And I believe this is the lightning spear. I could have thrown a uh, Lloyd's Talisman at it, but I don't know what I need. So I could go up that way, take the elevator. I'm not going to. Because I'm going to wait for that to get filled up. Yep, I'm going to go here. Got to cover this old serpent right here. That greatly increases your item discovery. Actually, you know what, I think that's the only way to get back up there, so I guess I will have to go this way. But you gotta be careful. After this thing goes up, it, well, if you didn't notice all the greasy blood stains, who says there's a heart attack in here on this? You gotta be careful because there's spikes up there. What's up, bud? It's nap time, man. You know that. What do you want? No, man. You didn't even take a nap. You laid down for like a half an hour and then you just came out here. Okay, go lay down. Yeah. And all you really have to do is just go up there. Now we can rotate this. This will unlock. to get oh I'm sorry uh big hat Logan come down there and grab him real quick just want to take a second Let's, hold on yeah I think I'm down there I can travel more freely so we'll go talk to big hat Logan get him unlocked so I got the master key I might as well Use the master key. Mm -hmm. Oh, heavens. Thank you. Clearly, as a matter of in my travels, that I must not be in the place and I will be in the river. I will return to the Farthing Shrine. Speak with me then. So See, this guy's like the badass sorcerer of all badass sorcerers. I don't see how he got caught in here. I honestly don't. Just like uh, the Pyromancer, soul of a hero. <clears throat> I can see how the other sorcerer guy, the, I don't know, when we pulled out of Lower Undead Bird. So I can see how he got caught, because he's kind of, a, kind of a pansy. But, these other guys, I mean, they're tougher than I am at this level. They're getting their asses kicked. Are they sending balls back down this thing again? Sometimes it does weird shit and like rotates on them. Yeah. So now it's getting sent back down here again. Come on, go. Alright, we've got there. 
this. Maybe there's a shortcut over here. Unlock. Uh, yeah, I get the uh, get sorcerers here. Oh, we already had that, but whatever. And then, yeah, here we are. This might be sure. Ah, this is what I was thinking of earlier. Oh, this is a fun one. Now, I usually do, so I just sprint my happy ass instead of trying to fight with them on it. Now, your best bet is probably take this guy out first. So once you go over there and start trying to fight what's his face. There's another snake-headed guy over in the corner. Well, at least he's got no uh, stability or poise. I'm deal with that. But you'll come over here and try to fight this guy, and a lot of the times that, that asshole will sneak up behind you. The only thing that's over here is uh, more large fight night shards. Ooh. That was dumb. I mean, that's the splash, so. Alright, those large shards are kind of handy. I love what my sword again. Oh, what am I doing? That's a ball. If you didn't notice, there's a guy right there just waiting to ambush you. Hopefully, he doesn't knock me off. Woo! Fucking close. Get out of here. Whoa! That was dumb. And the great thing is, once we get up here, I'm going to go straight to the bonfire. Because, yeah, I'm going to go to this. I'm going to go to this. I'm going to go to this. Let's see, we need more endurance, we need more dexterity. Yeah, let's go with that. Where's my hit damage up a bit? Nine. Yeah, I still don't have any shards, but. So we got the plus 9 which we got now. We need another large shard to make it a plus 10. And I believe I got a couple of chunks so we can... Uh, but that's going to have to wait. We have to get the very large ember. Which I'll get as soon as we get the... Lord Vessel. You could get it without that. You got to kill the old guy down there. I don't remember his name. But, uh... Yeah, hold on. Oh shit, he's gonna blow me up, I forgot. So I'm gonna blow up. Yay! You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna go back down here. And I'm gonna blow up my shit. Yeah. I'm gonna blow up some shit. Just got a plus 10. I'm rocking it now. Alright, I'm gonna wrap this video up here. We'll continue on right from where we started. And, uh, thanks for watching.